Hello. My name is Warren Navarro. Hello. And I have a question uh, about success. You said it's overrated. Mm -hmm. I'm curious why you work so hard to become a success, to get everything going. Yeah. I think that, that people define success differently. I just think it's overrated that people are, seem to be chasing success, but people are, you can be successful in anything you do. I, don't, I just think that you, know, it's, you get into a trap of constantly chasing um, success, and you can be successful in just about anything you do. Bruce, um, let's, let's drill down on that for yeah. a second, though. Sure. Uh, you said that, that, that success is overrated. Yeah. But you're not talking about all successes. You're talking about some sp measuring by money. Or, so let's try a different way. How do you define success? Oh, well, for me, success is about my family and, you know, being a better person and, and being a better dad and, you know, all, and all these, you know, just on being, uh, on being a better leader um, and constantly getting better every day. Um, but what about the success associated with the thousands of people you've lifted out of poverty? What about the success for being recognized as a world changer? Or more importantly, what about being the world changer? Forget being recognized. Um, yeah, I, I just don't equate those necessarily. That's success of the business, and I see myself outside of that. So, I mean, the business and what, what I do is, is successful. I just think that people define success differently, and it's such a big word that it's, I just find it overrated <laughs> because people are successful every day. You're successful in everything you do. You can be, um, and so people get into a trap of chasing it. Um, it's just like, and you know, it's combined, you know, our business model is, is, is you know, revolves around a, a model of happiness. and. And that's something people chase all the time too when it's right there for you in everything you do. Um, and you should look at how you define it personally, um, find what your motivation is and why you're, you're chasing success and how you define it. I mean, when you're first starting, sure, you want your business to be solid and you want it to make money. You want, it to, you want that turning point where you don't have to worry about you know, going, meeting going under. Meeting payroll. Yeah, meeting payroll and being, a, being t seen as a real business. There is yeah. a, there's a point where you're, you wake up one morning and you think, "Wow, you know, I've, th this is a real business. You know, I've reached." And I don't know if you if if you define that as success, but you you know that you you you've hit you've reached your goals, or you've you know you've done something that's. Um, but success is something that is ever evolving, and it's defined differently by everybody. So, did meeting the Dalai Lama have anything to do with uh, you changing your mind or changing the way you looked at success? Um, y not, no, it didn't change the way I look at success. I mean, it, it you know, being, uh, when, when you're successful, I mean, you get access to things <laughs> like the Dalai Lama, or you get access to things that um, are kind of fringe benefits of being successful. And like being invited on the TV show. Yes, like being here today. Um, but that doesn't necessarily mean you're any more successful than anyone else. I mean, you have to define what's successful to you. I think that people do. I mean, I meet people all the time that, think it's successful if you can drive a sports car or if you can have a big house or you, you know, they just define it differently. Um, but that's just not how I define it. I mean, I've, I've, I'm, I am, this, the company that I, that I, that I run in many ways is, it's, it's my destiny, I feel like I just, I, it's my, it's what I have to do. And I just feel that I'm the right person for, for it right now. But, and, and maybe in two years, I might not be that person. But right now I am. I know that I am. So that's, that's all I need to know. And that's my success.